Okay guys, this is my little, well, it's a bunch of things. It's kind of like my workout to have a Pilates machine over here. I have my desk over there. I have a little painting place right here. And then here is all my storage that I'll go through. Now, this is not complete. I just kind of put things where I know I want them to go, but I still have to, um, what do you call that? Organize it like I want it to be. Okay, so right here are my microphone and my recording device. If you can see right there, let me get this. Okay, don't mind that. I got to clean it. I got something on it. And I set it down. Um, yeah, so this is what I record with. So if you see, you can hear that hooks into this. And these are my earphones, so I can hear, but I don't have them in, so. I just guess on how loud I need to be. I bought this mirror. I got it on sale. I thought it was really cute. Hello, guys. I got it on sale, I guess. Okay. This is a big flower I was working on with my paper. I haven't really finished it. There's some white over there. Okay, so... This is my desk that I got. Okay. And this is where I edit what I do. So yeah, this is what I edit on my laptop. I hope you guys can hear me. And just I put some lights up there. And I don't know what I'm gonna do with each compartment. So and then, here's my lighting that I use. I also have lighting over here too. That was the first one I got. And then I got this one. So yeah, and then over here is my painting little place. This is in the way, which I'm going to actually move this over here because I'm going to use it for a second. Gonna put you guys on a tripod and we are going to look at these compartments real quick. So, here is my little painting place. Here's the winner of the giveaway. This is her package I need to send out. I have that right there. My little table. Um, I'm gonna say tripod, the easel. Easel. So, yeah. And then, let's see, right here is my Zen garden thing. Okay, so now I'm going to set you in to. Oh yeah, this chair is actually over there, but I put the whiteboard there, so I don't know how I'm going to fit everything, but anyway, I'm going to set you guys here in this tripod. I'm just going gonna, just gonna to go over, Ooh. I'm just going to go over. Some of the things in here, I'm picking up my microphone as we speak. Oh, no, it's stuck. Okay, let's make it loud. I usually stick my microphone in the back of my, my um, tripod. Like that. Okay, oops, wait. I gotta make sure I can see. There we go. Okay. Um, 
comes in so I can hear myself. Not how loud I am. I'm gonna hang that. This is a work in progress. But, and if I end up moving, I'm moving to a smaller place, so it's gonna be even harder. Okay, that's pretty loud since I put my earphones in, so I hope that it wasn't too loud. Okay, so how are you guys doing? I'm gonna back this up. I'm just gonna go over something. Bring my light over so you can see better. It's dark in here. Okay, so the first compartment right here. That out. Okay. So the first compartment. I gotta take this light down because it's pretty bright. But okay. Right there, that's pretty good. Okay, in the first compartment I have my what do you call these? Um tissue holders. Um, I don't have my Etsy store open right now, but if I do, I'm gonna sell some more of these. I like this pattern. It's, um, a floral pattern, and it has glitter on it. So, I have these in here. Here's the winter one that I made. Okay, and I also have my bookmarks. I might give some bookmarks away. I kind of want to do a series where I read books too, so I might do one and then give one of these away. And they fit really nicely in this package. So I can decorate it with paper. My paper art. Now I have earrings in here, which are pretty cute, I think. I made these on my embroidery machine. Those are little Christmas trees. So, yeah. Made those earrings. Okay, up here I have some co. Wait, I forget what these are called now. <laughs> Kodak markers. Now, I already used them all up, but I think I can get refills. So, there's the markers. Yeah. There's our fun to use. Those are some on top right now, but. Okay. Now, I'm not going to show you every compartment because of time, but, okay, I'm going to angle you down. <laughs> you probably can't see that very well, but, sorry. So, here's my other compartment. This is my like scrapbook or would you say planner compartment. So I have oops, my planner right here. And I'm gonna make, I should make some more planning videos. I like this planner a lot because it doesn't have the date so like I can pick up from any time I want. So I put my own date in here. There's my planner. Here's another planner, but it's out of date, so I'm just gonna use it to play around with. Um, I got stuff like stamps. I used my markers to color some of these stamps. Um, I got like glitter. I'm gonna keep my glitter in here. Um, I just got some other scrapbooking. Planner stuff, some here's some tape. I really like this tape. Um, also I got these um just a bunch of stuff to help me help um paper clips. These are paper clips. These are very cute. I love that color. So pretty. Um yeah, so um, Here's some stamps I actually carved myself. Um, I took some art classes, and this is a vase. 
don't know if you can tell that, but I use it for stamping. I don't know if you guys are interested in art, art kind of stuff, but I can do a stamping video. And here's a flower, but here, it's not that great. If you can tell, it's raised, and you carve this, and I have carving tools. So that's kind of fun to do, actually. Um, here's a little uh, stamper. It's kind of cool. I gotta move it. It's like that. And then I got markers back there. So that's not great. And I'm gonna go down. Down, down, down. Okay. I'm sorry if this angle isn't the greatest. So in this compartment, can you see that over there? In this little compartment, I have my embroidery thread. Now let me go ahead and show you what I make with that. So here's a snowflake that I made with that thread. I don't know if you can see it. I guess I gotta, I gotta um, zoom in on it or focus on it. There we go. This is one of the snowflakes that I had made on the embroidery machine. So, turned out really nice. I'm gonna use it for a, uh, I think I'll use it for a um, ornament. Okay, and like made this Christmas tree. These are earrings. And it's like a same thing. Brighter colors. I really like this one. I like that color a lot. Um, just like these earrings too. It's orange. So that's kind of stuff that I was making on my machine. So you got a lot of a lot of beautiful colors. I really like this blue color. It's very pretty. So yeah. All these are my all this basket. I really really like this basket and I got this basket at the Dollar Tree, so it was only a dollar. And it was super cute for only a dollar. It holds all my colors and actually right here is the color chart. If you want to see that, all the colors on the color chart. So yeah, there's quite a bit of colors, but that's pretty good. So back there is the backing for the um, embroidery. You have to put it back on it while it embroiders on the machine. I actually bought this for a video and I haven't used it yet. It's California White Sage. So if you'd like me to burn that in a video, let me know. I could do it for a um, to do it for a, like a meditation one or something. So, this one's pretty good. Okay, moving on. Okay, I'm gonna have to kind of move you. We're gonna take a little stroll to the left. Um, um sorry. Okay. <laughs> okay. This is my oops, let's get that out of the way. That's actually me. This is the soap section. Me and my mom embroidered the, I'm not embroidered, 
me and my mom filtered these soaps. I'll show you the one that I made. Oops, it's, I call this the heart garden, the garden of love. Okay, let's see if you, okay, there we go. Um, yeah, so I made this and I took a needle and you fill it. So I made that design. So this helps ex exfoliate. This helps exfoliate right your skin. Yeah. This helps exfoliate your skin. This is called the Love Garden. Garden of Love. So yeah, we are making these. Smells good too. Smell it. Smells good. Um, I think my mom made this one. It's very pretty purple. It's a simple design right here. These really work very well. I use them sometimes to wash my hands. Um, there's another one. I really like this one too. I like the colors. It's very pretty. So, um, and here's just some blank ones that we haven't put any designs on. So I don't know what we're gonna do on these designs, but this is kind of fun to do. And um, here's this pretty color. I love this peach color, kind of orangish, whatever. And in here. Here is all the mice and some of the outfits. I was gonna show you a needle, but I don't see one in here. Um, I don't know. Anyway. anyway, it's just a thin needle that you poke this in there with. So this is all the felt. Different colors. gonna want to close now. It's kind of hard to get that in there. Okay, so I'm gonna fix that later. Um, yep. So, yeah, um, I like making soaps too. So that's that compartment. Let's see. Yeah. Um, if I move you, okay, if I move you down, like right here, it's just like fabric. I guess I'm gonna be down just. I'm gonna be down, down, down. Okay. Not a great ankle, but. Okay, so this is like, this is my uh, yarn. This is my um, fabric little compartment. So, like. I'm, oops. I was practicing making a quilt and I made these squares, which they got string all over them. Sorry. So, yeah, I made this. If you can see, my back. I made this little block and this little block right there. It's gonna make a, like a blanket or something, not touch them, but I really haven't gotten that far. So that is folding it up, sorry. Um, yeah, so this is just a bunch of fabric in here. Fabric that I have not used. Or actually, fabric I have used. It's like leftover fabric in that one. So, let's look at this one right here. I don't know if I should take you out or not. 
I mean, I could lower the thing. It's gonna mess everything up, so. So we're further down. Sorry about me. trees I was making. Um, get a good close up of that and see. Um, I ran out of paper so I kind of stopped there but I got a little tree. I like these colors so I thought that was pretty. for art projects. I got this for my nephew. I want to put it together. Might make a video. I don't know. It's like a paper folding thing. Back here I got the rainbow slime starter kit and I accidentally forgot to do this. I actually was going to do it and I didn't have all the supplies, and then I totally forgot, so... Sorry guys, I'm behind on the times, but I might do that. I have these cute little, uh, containers, I don't know what I'm gonna use them for, but... I figured with all the tiny papers that I could use this for something. And, let's see. Got this little Christmas tree. Ornament. I'm just gonna try to decorate it. I got this glitter glue, iridescent. Don't really like it that much. Uh, um, glitter works better, I think. Like, just regular glitter. And we got some stuff. I bought this stuff to make rings with. I might do that actually.
And then here's the rings that go with it. Um, I'm gonna move you over the sign. This compartment right here. Get my light fixed. I can see better. It's so dark in this room, sorry. So this is also my cooling compartment. So I just have all my paper. Cooling paper is really hard to keep. Night, neat looking, so that's when I made these uh, origami papers. I have some uh, designs that I made in here. Here's a flower, paper flower. Paper flower. It's like a ring thing. It's kind of making like a mandolin. What are they called? Yeah, those circle things. I can't think of what they're called. Um, yeah. Here's a sun that I made. See that paper folded? A little sun. A little swirl in the middle of the sun. Yeah. So a little butterfly. Are you gonna pass a butterfly? Sorry, this is hard to hold. They're kind of little sun. It's a little butterfly. something else I'm here. Okay, so hello, hello. Okay. okay, so I went and got this to show you guys. This is a finger puppet that I made and it's I did it off of me. Or like, you know, the design after me. Because I wear my purple glasses. And my hair. So I made these. These are little uh, finger puppets for kids. So I might make more of these because I think they're pretty cute. I'll make some for my nephew. So yeah. Hello, kids. Should make a little children's little show. Be fun. Okay. So. Got some punches. I can make some flowers out of that. Um, here's a little board. This helps you to get your um your pieces to the exact size that you want. So yeah, and also to pin it down so you can glue it. Um, Show you, I'll show you a couple more things. Um, I made this Santa ornament. Oops. I made this Santa Claus ornament. I really like this one. It's like layered. His beard's layered. With a bunch of swirls. And then I put some glitter on it. I don't know if you can actually see that. He's got a little hat. I hope you guys can see that. Okay. And... Actually did another version. I gave him 
a green hat. Okay, I'm gonna set this up. Okay, I gave him a, a little the green and some of the white. So, if you can see it's layered. I really think these are neat. I need to make more, but you know what? I forgot how to make it already. So, I'll have to relearn how to do it, but I made two of those. I think they're super cute. And this little Christmas tree I'm working on. I use it as an ornament. It's not the best, but it's just playing around. And then this little flower. It's a flower. So that's about experimenting with these kind of uh, ornaments. Look at the curly cues on the side, but it didn't turn out that great. On this one, I was trying to carve a Santa face. My carving skills aren't that great. But yeah, this is polymer clay, I think. So that was kind of relaxing. Let me see what else is in here. I was using that for a backing of an ornament, but... Okay, so that's about it in here. Here's a big pink one I did, but that one did not... See, I think that looks cool. The lace. That kind of looks like lace. But it kind of popped open up here. I didn't glue it down. The great. The best. So I am. The ornament, and that's about it. And the, that's about it in the quilling department. So, way, way down here, see if I can make it go down a new bit of it. Okay. Um, and these two outer ones, this is, um, Yarn. Yarn. So right now, I'm working on a blanket. Which, I don't know. I don't know if you're gonna be able to see the stitches, but you might actually. Um, if you can see, these are just like straight stitches. This right here, there's like, I don't know if you can see, but it's a different pattern. I'm trying to learn that, and I kind of forget what it's called, but I've just been practicing that. Actually, I have a hard time with getting into something and then getting bored with it and going, moving on to something else, so. Yeah, so I need to stop doing that. So I, need to, I kind of forget how to do this now. So I need to sit down and try to make a blanket. Because I have all that yarn and this whole thing filled with yarn. So, yeah, I've got a ton of this yarn. Um, oh, this is the one I was working on. I don't know if you can see it, but I was doing it too tight. So, I gotta rip this out. See how it's curling? If you can see the pattern better right there, it's actually really pretty. If you can see that. Just like that, like that, like that. So, yeah. That is what I am working on with that. Okay. And here, over here is just, Over there is just more yarn. I mean, over there is just, um, more... Um, what do you call it? Uh, over there is just more fabric, okay? So, that about covers it with all these little hobbies over here. Um, so here. So, if you like this video, let me know. And I'll do the other side as well. The other side is mainly artwork, my painting and my watercolor, and like my markers and my pens, and also like scissors and tape and stuff like that. So 
If you like this video, I can do another one and extend it. Or I could just make this video really long, which I don't think people mind too much. So, okay, I'll think about it and I'll be back to you. Okay, so I decided to do a little bit more. I have like five minutes left on this card, so here is my, all of my markers. I don't know why this brush is here. Actually, I think I put it there for a role play. So now I brush. Okay. So here's these little compartments I got at the Dollar Tree. I actually got all these little uh, things at the Dollar Tree. I got all these at the Dollar Tree. As you can see, I have. Oh, hope you're focused. I don't know what I'm saying. Okay, so just. I got a bunch of colored pencils. I got a bunch of Sharpies in here. They kind of all fell over, but yeah, got a bunch of Sharpies in there. And pens and some pencils. My favorite type of eraser. Come on, that thing and anything you want. And then I got some more graphite sketch sets and got a drawing, some more drawing pencils. I got some pastel colors, pastels, I got some more colored pencils, um, dry erase markers, got this 18 piece art set, I think I got that when I was taking lessons, um, and a sharpener, got some lead in there for my and then I got some crayons back there and I got this like this um ge geometry set so, okay and then down here is about the same thing except oh I dropped a bunch of stuff it's my little sketchbook thing I have to stick those right there Same thing, but I got all my um, paint brushes in here. I should put this in the oh. I was talking about how I made those stamps. Well, here's the carving tool that I have. It's all the carving tools. This is a really cool pen. It's a elegant writer. I can you can do cool stuff with like watercolor. Um, I just got like this stuff and oops, watercolor brushes I really like. Just a different. I need to fix this because it kind of all fell. But for now, I got my, I got my sponge. I got smaller detail brushes back there. So I need to fix that. So, okay, and I have my art books, um, just painting, just watercolor paper, um, this is watercolor paper and drawing paper, oops, I'm so bad at anything, so, yeah, bunch of paper. So my, I have 20, I have 29 seconds and my 
memory card's completely full, so I'm gonna have to make a second video sometime. I don't know how soon I'm going to do it, because if I move, I might not have time, but if you like these videos, let me know. And I can show you more of this side. Here's my Lana Del Rey. You probably can't see it. So, if you would like, here's my rose. Can't really see. Can't okay, little clouds. Remember that, baby? There's my rose. Probably can't see. There's my rose. Um, if you, like I said, if you like this, let me know and I can make more. So. I hope you guys have a great day, and I hope you like this video. I'll talk to you guys later.